Hey guys, so today you're going to be getting ready with me for a fall day. Before I get ready, I look like a literal troll, so let's get to fixing that, shall we? I like to put my hair up and out of my face before I do my makeup, so I'm just putting it into a nice bun. Haven't had to be with someone for a while See me off as I go then I like to use my Nivea Soft Moisturizer to moisturize my face before applying my makeup. I then like using this random lip balm that I got for free in my business law class to moisturize my lips, which is actually one of the best lip balms I have ever tried, so that's pretty great. And after that, I go in with my CoverGirl Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation and use my Real Techniques Stippling Brush to apply it all over my face. The sky, the easier to see without the sea. I find that using the warmth of your hands to finish blending in your foundation really helps to make your makeup look super natural, which is definitely what you want with foundation. I then use my Maybelline Age Rewind Concealer to brighten up my under eye area and to cover up my dark circles. I then use my fingers to apply my Urban Decay Primer Potion, which really helps control my extremely oily eyelids and makes my eyeshadow last all day long. After that, I use my Maybelline Master Shape Eyebrow Pencil to fill in my brows. bronzer ever hula bronzer by benefit to contour my cheekbones nose and all around my face as well blush in the shade Plum Wine and I'm applying it on the apples of my cheeks. I'm then using the gorgeous gold color Half Baked from the Naked One palette to apply all over my lid. I have really been liking using the color Smog to blend into my crease because it creates dimension without being too harsh which is a really great look. I use the shade Virgin to highlight the center of my lids as well as the inner corners of my eyes and I just really like doing this because it brightens up the overall eye area and it just creates a really nice effect. I then use my Revlon Colorstay Liquid Liner to line my upper lash line and I usually start in the middle of my lid moving out and then I go back into the inner corner and then move that to the middle and then I just wing it out and I can honestly say I don't think that I'll ever get tired of winged liner. It is just my favorite thing ever. I then use a combination of my eyebrow pencil and the Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Liner to smudge onto my lower lash line. After that, I use my not so clear clear mascara to prime my lashes, and then I go in with my all time favorite mascara, the Maybelline Falsies. Oh, yeah, which I combined with the Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal because my eyelashes were just not having it that day, so sometimes you need three mascaras. I then use my favorite fall lipstick, the NYX Butter Lipstick in the shade Licorice, as the final touch, and that's the finished makeup look. I'm trusting in my feet. And I'm skipping. For my hair, I'm first making sure that it is all brushed out with my wet brush so that it's super easy to style. I'm then using the Batiste Dry Shampoo to spray in my roots to reduce grease and also add volume. We rode our bikes out in I then am using the It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product as a leave-in conditioner as well as a heat protectant. Off to explore the bins galore. I then am sectioning off the top section of my hair, pulling it up into a little bun, and then I am curling the bottom layer of my hair, starting at the back, wrapping it around the wand, holding it on there for a little bit, 
and then I let it cool in my hand and then I let it fall and just flip it back and then I do the same thing just moving forward. So I'm trusting you. Once the bottom layer is done, I make the bun just a little bit smaller and start with those sections that I've just pulled out. And I just do the exact same thing, wrapping it around the wand, starting at the back and moving forward. I then take down all the hair that has been left in the tiny bun and comb it all out and then part my hair with the comb to the side and then I'm all ready to finish curling my hair. And I'm following a trail that I've seen in fairy tales But the crumbs I left behind are gone So I'm trusting in my Once I'm done curling my hair, I just comb it through a little bit just to soften up the curls and then add some hairspray. Because I really hate it when my hair is in my face, I just take the front section of my hair and start twisting it all the way back. And then I'm just bobby pinning the twist to the back of my head using two bobby pins, and then I'm using some hairspray to just slick back some of those baby hairs, and then that's it, we're finished with the hair. Outfit, I am wearing my Nine West combat boots, my gray over the knee socks from H&M, my black floral dress from H&M, and my maroon coat from Forever 21. I am finishing my look off with a cream infinity scarf and my tan felt hat which are both from Bone. like this video guys if you did don't forget to give this video a like and comment down below also follow me and Aline on all our social media accounts check out our previous videos and of course don't forget to subscribe Let's try.